This is a one-star Roblox review, and today I'm gonna be testing that and many others to see if they're legit, starting with this one. This is a review about the recommended page on Roblox. It suggests me games like Vibe Place and Public Bathroom Simulator types of games. I don't play those games. I don't know, it kinda looks like you do. We gotta check to see if that's actually legit. Also, if you wanna know where I got all of these reviews, it's from this game, Roblox Reviews. To test if we get recommended those types of games, I'm gonna make a new Roblox account. I wonder if it recommends you different kinds of games depending what year you made your roblox account so i'm gonna make my roblox account about i think people born in 2006 are turning 18 this year i don't know all right i'll just go with this recommended all right so this is my new roblox account um recommended for me brookhaven it's actually not too bad right now i don't see any weird recommended games whoa bilberry city what's going on here there's a lady i've never seen this game before what kind of role play game is this all right we have to check that out what is this why is she on a yoga ball Huh? Maybe Roblox ruined me. Maybe this is a pretty innocent game. This is probably just clickbait to get people to join the game. Good to know that's being recommended, though. Is there any sus things in this game? I'm not too sure. This might be a roleplay for adults. Teens? Maybe not, though. No one's talking, though, which tells me it's for little children. This looks like it's just trying to be Brookhaven with ads. Oh, they have a fit buddy. You see that? With a AI woman. They're trying to get you to do exercise in Roblox. That's unheard of. All right, I think this one's okay. I think this game is kind of safe. It just kind of clickbaits you, hopefully. Any other games that are recommended? I do not see any vibe places or bathroom hangouts. All I'm getting recommended is probably for people under the age of 12 years old which is understandable this is all like roblox brain rot get eaten by james charles mm, no we do not support james charles on this channel not any i never did but so i think roblox fixed the recommended so now you don't get like vibe places or public bathroom simulator recommended to you unless maybe you played those types of games so don't for 17 plus the fact that only drinking games are the ones people are playing only tells me what kind of shenanigans occur in them so let's see are people only playing 17 plus drinking games let's check it out i mean the one with the most people in it is the mic up game drinks on tap does have 377 in it but other than that a lot of these games are like vibe hangouts let's go get some drinks and roblox let's see the shenanigans that go on in here what kind of shenanigans we got going on in this drinking game we got some black and extra this game is 17 plus. Its chat filters are allowed to be changed due to it being for more adults. Who are you talking to? Look at all these people getting drinks at the bar. Let's go over here. What else we got going on? It looks like David Bazuki. Please donate. No. Yeah, this looks like a pretty normal game. Maybe there's some weird characters here and there, but other than that, it seems fine. Unless I came out the wrong time. Let's see, let's sit. Can I get a drink? Make my drink faster. I want a drink. I want to get drunk. Let me just get drunk before I leave this game. This actually kind of feels realistic. I just want to get drunk and not remember anything. I think I died. Okay, so this was a review about Game Fam. There's too much game passes with high Robux prices, DDH, and it's breaking TOS on a broken record. You guys probably heard of Game Fam. They buy a bunch of games on Roblox. If we just type in Game Fam and look in the groups, these are all the games that they've bought in. They basically own a big part of Roblox. They're like the monopoly of Roblox, if that makes sense. They buy games and then they ruin them. So let's see. I think one of their most famous games is Sonic and SpongeBob. Bob. Ooh, that is a little bit expensive. The lowest that they got is 149 Robux. And what does that do? I don't know. I think it just gives you teleportation. So I've heard a lot about this game particularly. It's supposed to be like Pet Sim X or Pet Sim 99, but spongebob talk to spongebob dude i would rather leave him let him be stuck oh, he's telling me to do so many things i don't know if i want to do that um let me go check out the other games i can't play games just like simulators like that they kill me oh my gosh yeah maybe their game passes are a lot of money because look at that they have a subscription i guess any game can now have this but dang ten dollars a month what do you even get with that you get all the game passes but only for a month all right let's check it out i don't know if i would spend ten dollars a month on this game but that's just me is this a tycoon i feel like people play tycoons and then they don't care about them the next day that's how i am but then again i'm not a i'm not an eight-year-old girl i never cared about barbie i always like cut off the hair of barbies and would throw mine away wow i love this you know what guys i am gonna spend ten dollars on this so worth it i think game fam on this game has like the lowest reviews that i've seen um i would show more but they're basically like you know you messed up when the workers of your roblox group start 
start to unionize. I think they got in some hot water like last year because they were definitely doing some illegal stuff. They even came out with a tweet. This is like a side note. Game Fam had some really bad stuff come about them and they made a whole statement. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have already seen this, but it was really bad. They were basically trying to be like, we're amazing. We're great. We're not a terrible company. Celebration of company wins at quarterly all hands global meetings. That means they just probably throw you like a little pizza party. So I agree with a lot of these one star reviews. There's a lot of them. Pay your workers and stop stealing our games. All right. So this is a review on Roblox Tycoons. If you want to play good tycoon game, you will need to search to the bottom of Roblox, left and right, all 360 directions, add more directions and there's a good tycoon game that gets the MCA by Tech Simulator X because of the square lock. Um, let's see if we can find a good tycoon. Mega Princess Tycoon. Well, the next review. I think we might do that one because there's a one-star review on Princess Tycoon with a bunch of mad emojis. So I think that's the one we have to choose. This one's pretty popular, though. This has an age rating of 9 plus violence. Oh my gosh. I did not know that. Choose my princess. I guess I'm forced to choose Belle, right? It's pointing me in this direction. Helicopter? Wait, I gotta join on my main. I just- it said it was 400 Robux. Now it's saying it's 800 for me to buy the attack helicopter they're scamming what the heck the star creators have to pay more i'm not even gonna do the tycoon i'm just gonna ruin people's game there's a bunch of children running around and i want to ruin their day hold the phone i'm gonna buy this attack helicopter 800 robux there we go how do i use this there's the child i just want to show you something outside in my helicopter oh, there's a princess on the floor let's rip her to shred that did not go as planned. <laughs> okay, she's hurting me. That's mean. There's nothing. I just fly in this helicopter. I can't even hurt them. This was a waste of money. She said in the chat, go away. What if I don't want to? Come outside. Face your fears. Oh, I can't drive. Face your fears, you princess. You'd think that they would make this easier to drive considering I spent 800 Robux on this. This is terrible. This is a terrible game. That was definitely not worth it. This like but yeah i agree there's not a lot of good tycoon games on roblox they're very hard to come by and they're usually just money grabs if anything i agree with sari they are hard to come by so let me tell you about this tycoon that is super cool and is not a money grab hi i'm one of the editors scaremouch and i'm of course talking about car ride tycoon it's a super fun two-player tycoon with 30 unique cars to collect and 10 different pickaxes and what? lots of secrets for you and your friend to explore and it's actually made by another of sari's editors our lovely boy c and he's made it so that you can use Use code Sari to collect 350 car coins that allows you to purchase the brand new forklift cart, which comes with some pretty cool forklift mechanics and looks overall very fancy while you're zooming through the caves. So check it out right now, please, or I will come to your house. Thank you. So anyways, were any of these one-star reviews valid? Yes, pretty much all of them. For once, the Roblox community was actually right. 